On June 27, 2019 $6 million lawsuit filed against a tractor-trailer company by a Tennessee man claiming general negligence. On the morning of May 1, the plaintiff and his wife were coming to an intersection and the same time as the semi-driver. The lawsuit claims that the truck driver pulled into the intersection, blocking both lanes of the roadway, the shoulder, and half of the median. There was no way for the couple to avoid a crash given the circumstances. The suit also claims that the truck driver was driving fast when he tried to make the turn. The plaintiff suffered a broken hip, in addition to multiple fractures to his right femur and ribs. The female passenger died. The lawsuit seeks damages for his injuries and the loss of his wife. One count of failure to yield right of way was cited for the truck driver. In these kinds of circumstances, plaintiffs are desperate for money to pay their bills and have little choices. Litigation funding is not only a feasible option, but it is also risk-free. An insurance company knows families are helpless and they will often take advantage of that fact by making a low settlement offer. Victims should never take any deal from an insurance company unless they have consulted with an unfair death attorney. Legal financing help cover medical expenses, funeral, and burial expenses, or simply pay the monthly household bills. Legal financing can also give the plaintiff's attorney time needed to investigate the case and to attain the reparation rightly deserved. Pre-settlement funding, or a lawsuit loan, is a cash advance secured to the personal injury claim. Repayment is only due once the case is settled successfully. If there is no recovery, repayment of the lawsuit loan is totally waived, making it a virtually risk-free cash advance for the plaintiff.